But this is a common question you might get at GCSE and about logic. So we've got an alarm system that sounds if either the pressure mat is activated, i.e. someone steps on it, or the window sensor is activated, i.e. it's switched on. It'll only operate, um, however, if the main switch is turned on. So it'll operate if either the mat or the window is triggered. So we have an OR. But it will only operate if the main switch is on. And for that, we need an AND like this. And so the output there, uh, only if that's the case. So if the mat is activated, it'll be a one here. But if the main switch is off, then nothing happens here. But if the main switch is turned on with a one, then as long as both of these are zero, i.e. there's nothing happening there, then the alarm won't go off. But if one of those, the window or the mat, is activated, then this becomes a one. This is a one. And so the output is a one and the alarm comes on. So that's a very common question at GCSE, which is the alarm system um, circuit.